Brussels, capital of Belgium, principal seat of the Belgian royal family, and capital of the European Union, is a remarkably small, easygoing, and human-sized city for all its importance. Unlike beautiful Bruges and Ghent, with their hordes of tourists, Brussels is Belgium's main economic and educational hub, which gives the city a more workaday feel than other towns. Number 10. Royal Gallery St. Hubert. Built in the popular, ornate Italianate style, with a glass panel roof and arched shop fronts, the grand 213-meter-long arcade revolutionized retail architecture in Europe. Replacing the narrow market alleys that had gone before and becoming the continent's first shopping center. Number 9. Cupola View. The Kokelberg district is dominated by the massive Basilique Nationale du Sacre Coeur, the fifth largest church in the world and brainchild of Leopold II. Begun in 1905 to mark the country's 75th anniversary. Number 8. Museums of Parc du Cinquantenaire. Its centerpiece is the monumental Palais du Cinquantenaire, the two wings of which, linked in 1905 by a massive triumphal arch designed by the French architect Charles Giralt, house two of Brussels' most interesting museums. Number 7. Notre Dame du Sablon. The 15th to 16th century Church of Notre Dame du Sablon, generally considered one of the loveliest late Gothic churches in Belgium, was built as a replacement for a small chapel first erected on the sandy expanse of the Sablon by the Crossbowmen's Guild in 1304. Number 6. The Atomium. Along with Mannequin Piece, the Atomium is Brussels' best-known landmark attraction, and although it's a bit of a journey by tram to get out here, the bizarre 102-meter high steel and aluminum structure. Designed by the architect Andre Waterkeen for the 1958 Brussels World Exhibition, is the city's most surreal site. Number 5. Koningsplein. A favorite attraction for photo ops, the most important building on this square is the Royal Palace, which is used by the Belgian royal family as an official residence. Number 4. The Belgian Comic Strip Center. This gorgeous 1906 building, designed by Victor Horta, is home to the wonderful Comic Strip Center. Devoted to the history of cartoons and comic strips in the country that gave the world the Smurfs and Tintin.
Number 3. St. Michael's Cathedral. Dedicated to St. Michael and St. Gudula this Gothic church was first founded in 1225, but only completed in the 15th century. The facade is impressive, rising majestically above a broad flight of steps and crowned with twin 69-meter-high towers designed by Jan van Roosbroek. Number 2. Mannequin Piece The mannequin is, however, surrounded by various legends. According to one, the fountain is a memorial to a courageous infant who averted a conflagration, according to another. It commemorates the son of a count who succumbed to a pressing urge while taking part in a procession, Number 1. Groat Market Much of the square's elegant character is due to the unique architecture of its elegant Gilda Wizen with their magnificent gables, pilasters, and balustrades, ornately carved stonework, and rich gold decoration. <laughs> 